Hello friends, welcome to Electronic Circuit Hub. So today we are going to learn about the BJT common emitter amplifier by using LT spice simulation. So in this experiment, we will learn how BJT works as a amplifier. And let us say, let us say if you you are having a small input signal let us say 10 millivolt so what would be your what would be your output signal right and what would be your amplification gain so in this experiment i will show you the input signal small input signal i will show you the the output signal okay so as you can see here i have already drawn the schematic and i hope until now you are also able to the, draw the schematic in the LT spice okay so if you still are not able to draw the schematic in LT spice you may watch my previous videos where you can learn how to draw the schematic in LT spice okay so at the end of this video i will upload this file in the google drive and i will give you the link in the description section so you may go to the description section and you can directly download this file and you can build and simulate and you can do some experiment by building your own amplifier circuit right so uh, let us start the video now you can see here we have a input voltage small input voltage which is a sinusoidal voltage of 10 millivolt at 1 kilohertz frequency so maybe I will add one label here for input voltage. So this is our input voltage, right? And this is our output voltage. So here we, we are having V out, right? Here we are having V out. So this is V out. Okay. You can see here we are having this is the source. So it is sinusoidal source with dc offset voltage 0 amplitude 10 millivolt with the frequency of 1 kilohertz right and this is the coupling capacitor 10 microfarad this is the potential divider biasing of an amplifier this is the transistor bc847 then we have here uh, this bypass capacitor of 1 microfarad 47 microfarad right you can delete this this Y pass capacitor is let me rename it 47 how how I can rename let me click it here and the uh, when I did it's a C5 right okay so this is the bypass capacitor this is also also a coupling capacitor which is connected at the output and this is the load this is the supply collector supply voltage and here we have a ground so this is input this is output hope you understand the circuit flow of bjt common emitter amplifier so now if you want to run the run the transient analysis you have to go simulate edit simulation command and i have set up the stop time is 10 millisecond so this is guys here here transient is written so this is dot trans commands okay so click it okay go at this button run button and you will get the second window you have to go window here tile vertically now you got two window one for schematic and other for simulation right so i will divide it to two parts so add plot pane this is for input let us say this is for input and you can see this is for input 10 millivolt peak with 1 kilohertz frequency and this is for output v out this is having around you can see you can see this is having around 1 volt 1.08 volt peak to peak so so hope you understand the transient analysis of bjt common emitter amplifier right hope, hope you hope you understand this what is the input signal waveform and what is the output signal waveform right if you want to change the color you have to right click it here then 
you can change the color so this is the input v in and you can see this is the v out you have to remove the cursor here okay so hope you understand the the this experiment and uh, now you are able to simulate your own amplifier and you are also able to build your own amplifier if you have any question feel free to ask me in comment section thanks for watching this video